This is our uh, lift for golf carts. This is our prototype. Uh, we've got it set on a frame just, just to get the height. And we've got it set 12 inches off the floor. Uh, of course, it can be made lower or higher depending on customer preference. Uh, this is in the fully deployed position. And we're going to put my wife on a wheelchair on this thing and show you how it operates. So come on up. A little bit more. Come up. There you go. Right about there. Okay. Now we don't have our uh, we don't have our safeties and our switches and our all that wired up yet. We're just doing this straight off the battery. But there will be safety stops for up and down positions. Okay, that's completely up. Now normally on, on a finished product, that area that's open would be actually part of the floor of the golf cart. Uh, the floor of the golf cart will extend out to where the uprights are. So this all becomes part of the floor. Now then, she weighs about, uh, mm, about 100 pounds. <laughs> and the wheelchair weighs uh, probably about 150 pounds. So you're looking at, a, at about 350 pounds there. So let her down again. And then we're going to then we're going to change the game a little bit. This thing is very slow, very smooth, and the weight is no problem, and that's what I'm fixing to show. I'm going to add about 225 pounds to this. Okay, that's me on the platform. All right, let's see what happens. If we go the right direction. No problem. We come up level to the floor. All you got to do is just wheel over in there. Now this this particular unit uh, is sized for someone that wants to use a scooter, uh, like a Bruno scooter, and uh, pull straight across and turn their seat to operate the, the cart. Uh, go ahead and back off there. And uh, in order to actually have room to put a wheelchair on and turn, the, the whole mechanism would have to be about a foot, foot wider. Of course, we can make it up to six foot or eight foot or whatever the customer desires as far as the width, depending on the application. Now then, this is, this is in the fully deployed mode. Now we're going to go to the transport mode. you got to pick it back up first, Randy. Pick the... <laughs> You pick up the uh, the platform and bring it back up to level. Of course, this is unpainted, unfinished. This is this is a rough finish. When you paint these things up, they're going to look real good. Now we've got. The actuators that we've got on this right now are geared pretty slow, of course, which gives more power. But they've got so much more power than you need that they could actually be geared faster. Uh, we've got everything where it works real slow and smooth right now. Now, once you get this deployed, of course, this is going to be a matter of remotes and uh, just switching. Now, these are the outriggers, which help with the counterbalance on this thing. And once you get it ready to go, the outriggers come up and they fold the platform up to where it's straight up and down and out of the way. Of course, we've got an automatic uh, flipper ramp on the end there that, uh, that will go up or down to keep you from rolling off the edge of the, of the unit. And there it is. It's ready to go. This unit could be... Uh, built and packages to where you just take the unit and uh, build your cart around it, build your extension around it, 
and it should be real easy to operate. And this is made by Randy Gressett and Roy Aiken at RV Wheelchair Lifts of Texas. Thanks for watching.